right, you all. So we are gathered here today to talk about this book right here. My love for books has been lifelong. All throughout my teenage years and into my adult years, the library is still a sacred space for me. I had to pick this book up because it fused together my love of books and my love of handbags. I was just doing a Google search one day and decided to Google history of handbags. And you know, a lot of fun information popped up, things I didn't know, you know, um, websites I've never seen. But what I didn't realize was that there are actually books that are written with this subject matter the history of handbags. The handbag, an illustrated history. O-M-G, the plethora of information, history, beautiful pictures. It is an absolute joy to have in my book collection. With you, I did wanna just skim through some of the pages just to show you some of the eye candy in this book. There are vintage models in the book. It talks a lot about the history of some of our favorite designers. There are lots and lots wow. of great information. And like I said, there's a few other books out in the world written specifically for handbag enthusiasts, collectors, Look at this lovely picture. Okay, this is a vintage picture. It's a 60s model. And she is here rocking two Gucci belts, a Gucci travel bag, and a matching shoulder bag. So obviously the, that was for some sort of advertisement, but that's pretty dope. So if you're ever interested, jump on to Amazon and check it out for yourself. Again, this one is the handbag and illustrated history. And there we have our good old fashioned Louis. I'd like to go ahead and read a little excerpt from this book for you all. The bag is the most fashionable of all accessories. The one designer item many women are prepared to invest in. The designer handbag is no longer the preserve of the elite or those with celebrity status. And there is a magical reason for this. Unlike designer clothes with handbags, one size fits all and the ownership of the most fashionable is not precluded by anyone's race, age, social status, or weight. This picture right here is showing the girls. Everybody's holding a small little baguette. Let me see if you notice. They all got a little something something. And what's going on here is the ladies is finally coming out, okay? They're leaving the house more. They need to have their essentials with them, okay? And so the ladies are starting to rock their stuff. And it's just delightful, historical anecdotes like this that just has me smiling as I look through this book. I definitely would love to get to the bottom of these despicable clock bags definitely not one of my faves. I'm interested in finding out the history behind it. So I'm sure this book will go deep into that. So that'll be interesting to learn as well. This is gonna be good. All right, 
right, ladies. Well, thank you all for letting me share. I just wanted to come in and talk to you about this new handbag book that I recently picked up and just wanted to let anybody who's a reader know about it. You might find some enjoyment, you know, get some entertainment and some education out of this book. So if you're interested, please head on over to Amazon. Um, they might still have a couple copies. And like I said, there's different type of books on the subject matter. So those are on Amazon as well. Alrighty, that is it for now. I will talk to you all soon. As always, I wish you peace and love.